So nearly everything we knew about this fracture case has actually been wrong at this moment in time. But luckily, we're going to go over all the new news that we know about it. What I am talking about is actually the unboxing numbers for this fracture case as all the previous numbers have actually been inaccurate, but luckily we are aware of the mistake. Now what I am talking about is the monthly unboxing numbers, and well this is where FJED, YP Salon, and also Mertis have also figured out that they did make a little bit of a mistake when calculating the total number of fracture cases. Now the flaw in the mistake which they did actually do is actually kind of funny when you look at it, but not that humorous when you realize many people are investing based off these numbers, so it is really important to correct it. This is where the flaw is from, instead of calculating the number of Battlescar Desert Eagle print streams, they actually went ahead and counted the number of Battlescar M Frey 1S print streams. This does obviously mean that the total supply for these cases were completely wrong, which is why the fracture case in the last few months was getting looked at as a case which wasn't getting unboxed at all. You can look for the last few months like June, July, August, and even September. There was only a few hundred thousand which was known to be getting unboxed for the fracture case, but in actuality there was millions of them. For instance, in June, there was over 1 million cases open than what was actually reported. July had 2.4 million in total. August had 2.6 million in total and September had 2.3 million in total. This does actually mean that this case is getting mass unboxed and what was theorized for many months now was that since this case wasn't getting unboxed nearly at all was that it would be the next case to go but with these new numbers it does completely change that around. The fracture case has some of the most demanded knives at the moment including the skeleton knife, nomad, survival knife and also the paracord. Many people unbox this case hoping to grab some case hardens so this is the updated information which we know about this case at the moment. Saying all this though, this is definitely something people should be taking note of, as it was widely expected for the fracture case to be going out next, but with these new unboxing numbers, it does show it is completely demanded for. Whether Valve decides to add it to the rare drop pool next is something we will just have to wait to see, but now we are aware of the case's actual demand. 